Early morning in Zacatecas, in the grasslands of north central Mexico, and local hunters are out in the countryside. Here, amid the prickly pear, they compete with rattlesnakes and eagles for their quarry, rats. But these aren't pests. They are a highly sought after delicacy in this part of the country, where only the best specimens will do. City rats are very dirty, but these are country rats and you can eat them. These animals live on prickly pear and a great variety of herbs. That's why they're nutritious, because they are clean animals. Pedro sells his merchandise across the state, where it's a sought-after food. It's unique to Zacatecas, and for biologist Manuel Macias, there's science and method behind the apparent madness. The amount and variety of amino acids and proteins found in these rats is marvelous for such a small animal, not weighing more than 80 grams, so they are very important in their own ecosystem. And this is where the rats end up. While the rest of the country may abhor the practice, here in Zacatecas, rat soup is a popular dish. Indeed, local custom sees it as something of a cure-all, with even pregnant women encouraged to believe there's no sustenance more nutritious than this rodent broth. Arturo Palomar serves his famous rat soup every Wednesday and always sells out long before closing time. Today I've sold 100 litres. I have clients from Guadalajara, Monterrey, Aquas Calientes, even people from the United States who come every six months to eat my rat soup. For his clients, like Jose Monreal, who today lives in the US, it's a taste of his childhood. As a child on my family's ranch, we would hunt rats and bring them to my mother, who would make stew with them. So since I was here and had the chance to come, I said I was going to eat rat soup. Delicious, highly recommended. When it comes to eating meat, for many people, what matters is how the animal lived. So for the people of Zacatecas, a wild rat whose life was spent roaming fields of cacti seems perhaps more appetizing than an industrially farmed chicken that never saw the light of day. Just food for thought. Alastair Bavastok, CGTN, Zacatecas, Mexico.